Hello, welcome back to the channel. Day 15 of the garden room build, four by three, and she is coming along rather tastily. So as you can see, the roof is now all glued on and in, faces and soffits are done. There's two bits of trim around either side that you see finishing off, they're about eight inches long, but I've just had to order some like joining clips. So you see the center there, they were just shy of uh, giving me two of those just to finish it off. So they're on the way, so then that'd be the roof 100% finished better a piece of cake to fit it won't take any time uh internally you can see it's looking quite quite different now that the old steel is here and the roof is now lowered back onto the steel plasterboarding done done and dusted so not only did i manage to get the vapor barrier on so what i had to do early was drop all the top boards get the vapor barrier it's about head down here put the enemy full tape behind it put this back on and then I tack the ceiling. All done, dusted. I use my, um, where are they? There they are. These lovely little guys is like my, dead man, dead man's, dead man's, I can't remember. If someone remembers, drop it in the comments. Uh, but to hold the boards up, because these are like the full uh, eight by four sheets. So trying to do it on your own is a bit of a bugger, but with those things, it's a breeze. Uh, so that's all tacked and ready to go. Managed to get the vapor barrier on the supports as well. So the plan for tomorrow is, ah, and before somebody asks, no, I'm not plasterboarding this. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut 18 mil ply and put one big length across the top, two bits, and then do single bits down each one of these. And the reason I'm gonna do that is because when the window's going, I'm gonna finish this then with a lovely bespoke trim that'll go around, very simple, square edge, and a bit across the top. And so, it saves me plastering and messing around because literally the 18 mil ply, once it's on there, I could just paint it. So it's like, well, I might as well just do all of it with that. Done and dusted. Also, it's a bit tougher and harder than plaster. So as people are coming in and out, it'll take a bit more punishment, you know, where it needs to. Um, and that is kind of it, really. So tomorrow will basically be one of these days. That's right, plastering. So it's all taped up. So it's ready to rock and roll. Top tip, always tape your corners. Don't not do that because you're going to get cracks. You're going to get cracks in these anyway, okay? You're always going to get finite cracks in timber frame buildings, especially these ones, because that's what it is. It's a moving, living thing. As a, the, the um, wood expands and contracts, you're going to get cracks. But what this does is by taping these joints, it really does minimise it. So just, just do it. You won't regret it. Uh, so yeah, tomorrow's the day of plastering. In between the plaster and skimming, I will probably get USB 3 onto the front of these bad boys, which is already pre-cut. So down this is a matter of like shooting some nails into it to get it done. And then I will possibly get the baton and the breathable membrane on there as well. So that's all done. So tomorrow, and play tomorrow should be a good day actually. Plastered, all this ready to rock and roll, and I'm ready for shiplap on the front and the sides then, and obviously decorating. So yeah, come Friday, should be decorated and the floor should be in as well. I'll show a few tips and tricks about that, which I think you'll really enjoy. Um, that's it, done. Happy days, really is happy days. Oh, I'm so happy the steel's here. This is a happy man right now. Um, so yeah, looking good, happy, very chuffy. Thank you very much. If you like it, subscribe, press the bell icon. It really helps me out. And yeah, I'll continue to do little tips and tricks and stuff. And if they're any good to you, then just, just drop me a comment. If you've got any questions, Drop me a comment. I'm always happy to answer questions. No problem at all. See you later, everybody. Take care. Bye.